everyone, my name is Paula Gilmore from CPD For Me and I'm your host today. So we have Steve Mark, who's a lawyer by profession, having initially studied in America, the country of his birth, and subsequently in Australia. He practiced law with a private firm for five years, specialising in criminal law before travelling to England, where for three years he practiced in criminal, immigration and human rights law. He was president of the New South Wales Anti-Discrimination Board from 1988 to 1994. So solicitors may claim one CPD unit for ethics and professional at the end of this session. So over to you, Steve, thank you. What I'm gonna be talking about today is of course, ethics in the time of COVID. And by talking about ethics in the time of COVID, what I'm really gonna be talking about is how do we deal with some of the changes that have happened because of the pandemic? And particularly, how are we gonna cope with what happens when we start going back to work? And some of us might not want to go back to work. So how are we gonna do things remotely, et cetera? So I'm gonna be talking about a lot of that sort of stuff uh, because some things have changed and some things haven't. So hypothetical one, Joe Bloggs has been a long time client of your firm and is a director of a successful company that the firm advises. You receive a call from Joe's son, Ralph, a major beneficiary under Joe's will, along with Joe's long estranged wife, Anita, that Joe has suffered a stroke and Ralph has concerns about Joe's mental capacity. Two weeks later, Joe arranges an appointment with you via Zoom. He asks you to transfer all the shares in his company and his investment property to his new girlfriend, Bianca. So the question is, what do you do? 